Hi everybody, it's Deb from D&D Art Gallery. Hope you're all doing well today. I have an 18 by 24 gallery wrap canvas. As you can see, I've put down a layer of navy uh, blue paint that I had made up. Uh, it's very dark because I added uh, to the phalo blue, I added black and dark green. And today I'm going to do a a split cup dirty cup pour and I'm just going to have some fun with it and let the paint uh, run all over the canvas. Um, I actually hope to leave a little bit of um, uh, negative space or negative areas on here. So let's get started and I will put in the description all the paints that I'm using. I used several and I already have them um, layered in my split cup as you can see. I can tell you that I'm using um, silver and artist loft copper, a lot of the king paints and like I said I will put that in the description. Um, pouring medium is uh, two parts Floetrol to one part paint and no silicone is added. So let's get started. I'm just going to um, start layering this paint on my canvas here in no particular pattern or order and I did um, I did layer another little cup to add to this if needed I'll just have to see how this goes very pretty colors in here. I got some purple coming up, some yellow. Just thought I'd have some fun today. Here's some light yellow. No silicone added if I didn't say that already. And I may not need that second cup. Looks like I have quite a bit here. Okay, and because I do love copper so much, I'm actually going to add some copper in here. Just here and there before I start tipping. I think copper and the deep dark blue is a very, very pretty combination. Okay. So I'm just going to do a little tipping on this now. I already see some cells popping up. This is a little bit bigger canvas than I normally work with. I did add a, a squirt of GAC 800 in all my paints today also to help prevent the crazing or cracking. Okay, I'm just going to set it down here and take a look a minute. I do like the negative space I have here. And I would like to keep that. Okay. 
I do think the, the area up in this uh, upper corner here is a little bit too plain. So what I think I'll do is I'm going to scrape some of that off. And I may add just the, the dark blue paint up in that area for more negative space. Take a look at how that looks. And I'll do a little bit of tipping up there. Okay, and I'll bring it back down here. I think I'll tip it back this way a little bit. Just to get some of this paint off of the canvas here. And now I'll bring it back. And I'll set it down and take another look here. I think I will just tip a little bit more up into this corner here. Let's take a little bit more off that corner. Okay, bring it back. And I will take another look now. I think I will take my um, popsicle stick and just take this copper, maybe just draw it up here a little bit to break this up a little. And 
and maybe a little bit down here. I am very happy with how much copper did come through on this painting. And I think I'll just run it through here. Just, just breaking it up a little bit. Just breaking up a few of those areas that I look that I think look a little bit too plain. And now I think I will torch it. Let me see what I can do down here if I want to do anything. Okay, let's do a torch. Okay, <clears throat> let's clean off the bottom here a little bit. And I will get you down for a close up. Again, this is an 18 by 24 gallery wrapped canvas. That I did a dirty cup split split cup pour on. And you can let me know what parts you like and what you don't like. This is the upper left hand corner here, and I really do like how the stripes um, turned out. Very pretty. Turquoise red, navy blue. And then I had a wine color in there. You can see it right in there. And the silver came up. This is really pretty down in here. That's the lower left-hand corner. Again, I'm very happy with these stripes. Some purple came up in there. This is going up the middle. A lot of copper, which I'm happy. I love copper. And I was and I left some negative space there. The upper right hand corner. And this is the part that I really did want to be able to save this purple in here. And this is very pretty in here. It's a lot going on, very bright painting. And this is the lower, the lower right hand corner. So let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it. Subscribe if you haven't. 
make sure you ring the bell and choose all so you know the next time that I do post a new video. And until next time, take care, everybody. Thank you for watching. Bye.